Hi guys, um, I'm just going to show you how to use that program called Super. Um, it converts um, video format and stuff like that, um, extracts audio and all sorts of things. Okay, so I've actually got it running on another computer that I've remote desktop to. So here it is here. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to put a file in there. I mean it's really easy it looks complicated okay with all these settings uh, but it's not so what we're going to do is every time I mouse over here this area here it says um, well it brings up these rules okay um, but all I have to do is drag and drop a file in here now I can also right click and this huge menu comes up and I can say add multimedia files and I'll press on that and I can just go and search for them wherever they are so I'll just go back and um, in here and I'm just going to choose um, these are video tutorials I'm just going to choose one okay and there we go now it's put in there now I can also just go and grab one like this I'm just going to drag it down so I'm going to left click on it and hold my button down oops sorry I've double clicked on it accidentally I'm just going to pull it down drag it and then let go and there we go now I've got two there now if I just want to work on one at a time I'll just take that away but if I'm doing a whole batch of them I can have them all there ready to go with the ticks in the boxes if they do if they're getting converted to the same thing well that's it it's great okay so what I'm going to do is go up the top here now this is the first part that you choose now the rest of it they choose it for you really but you've got the option of changing them okay so what we've got here is the output container which is what format you want it in um, here's the codec that you want it in okay the choices change it depends on what you choose up here and this is also the audio that you can choose now like I said it, it all changes so what we do is we go back to this list here and we go down and we choose which one we want now there's heaps here as you can see look even for the mobile phones okay um, this one here is interesting and here we're going to make it into a VOB file which is a DVD um, format um, or we can also take the audio out of it and forget about the video that's good for taking music out of a video or something or whatever maybe you want to um, take the audio out and then make a little ringtone for your phone or something like that um, you can do all sorts of things that's how they do it um, yeah here we go Nokia um, you just have to find out what um, audio um, format suits your phone okay so I'm gonna press on this one okay now what happens is it's changed the settings for me okay it's changed it to MPEG-2 already and it's AC3 now okay this is what it's chosen it to now what it's done is narrowed the choices down of what you can do for this actual one okay so what I'm going to do is go down the bottom and I'll make sure I've only got that one ticked and I'm going to press encode okay now this says use it something's come up here use the original file name added with a um, VOB extension or use the standard DVD compliant one okay press OK that's fine with me now it says it's encoding and I'll show you where I've put it in a minute okay now when it's finished you can just right click anywhere and I go to output file saving management now I actually made a folder 
to um, store everything in and all I did was choose it okay um, see how it's got h slash output for super now that's exactly where it's going now if I want to see the uh, um, just press save changes because I'm still there now if I want to see um, where that is <coughs> and go in here and have a look for it there it is there open that up now there's the VOB folder that I created earlier okay um, now these are all the output things that I've done um, this one here I took the audio out of a video so all you get is sound um, and I put it into mp3 format um, yeah I did a couple of things it was really great um, alright thanks for watching I hope this helps